When Designer 4 is open, you will see the welcome screen. You can start a new project, open a project, or resume the last project, or select to go to our website to watch tutorial videos. It's also going to connect, and down here you'll have an indication on whether it's connected or not. It does require an internet signal for it to connect when you log in, and then it, it'll check for your licenses once every 24 hours. If this icon is showing red or yellow, it means that there is an issue with its connection. Go to your manage and check your login to see if there's a problem or check your internet connection to make sure that you are online. The file menu is accessed by clicking on the blue shell in the top left corner. This is where you can create new projects, open projects, save projects, compile or upload projects, manage your account, have quick access to Carverite help, and exit the program. It'll also allow you to open your recent documents as they'll be displayed here. If you click on manage, this will open up your account management window. It is divided into five tabs, account being your account login information, your licenses, where your licenses will be displayed along with your patterns, projects, and collections. These patterns and projects can also be installed directly from this interface right onto your computer and into your pattern library. Any licenses that you do not have will appear with a red square around that tool in your toolbars indicating that it is there in demo mode for you to try but not available for you to save, upload, or compile. Machines is where you register your CarveWrite machines and add new CarveWrite registrations. Storage is how you manage your memory card. And About is where you can access your computer ID and find your CarveWrite software logs. Down below you'll see a renew and release. This is how you release this computer from your account or renew this computer's registration. When finished, you click Done, and it returns you back to Designer. We'll start a new project here, just so we can go through the toolbar layout. To create a new board is the same as previous versions of Designer. Uh, you can type in your length, width, and thickness, or if you're making a rotary project, you can type in the dimensions of your rotary cylinder. I'll make a smaller board for demo purposes, 12 by 5 and a half at 3 quarter inch thickness. Click OK. The board then appears on the screen. You'll notice now we have a orientation cube that can allow you to help rotate and understand where your direction is. Designer 4 has reorganized all of our tool sets to make it easier to use and a much more organized workflow. We've taken our tools and we have combined them into these tabs to make them organized in a way that is easier to find and, and makes more sense, especially for new users. Uh, we've got our board set up, our carving, vectoring, and importing, uh, as well as our input toolbar here which is the same as older versions of Designer. We've got our orientation toolbar, which allows us to manipulate views and orientation of objects. And we've got our default drawing and selection toolbar here, complete with the text tools. And our drawing suite toolbar with the more advanced drawing tools. Over here we have our carving list and pattern library and tabs. Uh, which can be closed or opened. In the pattern library, we've replaced the favorites folder with a folder called My Patterns. It contains all the patterns you've downloaded or made. We also continue to have a search, so if you have a large pattern library and you're looking for files, you can use the search to find them more quickly. We've also added a store tab here with a search that allows you to search any 
patterns that are in the Carverite Pattern Depot. It'll find those patterns and then allow you to drag and drop them right to the board to try. You can also double click on them to see a larger preview of the pattern, the price point, and get a link directly to the Carverite Pattern Depot to purchase the pattern. Under board setup, you can change the size of your board directly from the board setup tab. You can change the board surfaces and we've added a larger number of board textures. You can set it to be glossy or flat depending on what kind of finish you want to display. You can set the uh, thickness of an inner material in case you want to represent some kind of veneer finish and using these display and view tools you can turn that on or off. The lighting tools, you can change the direction or intensity of the ambient light. The grid interval allows you to manipulate the grid on your board and uh, allows you to center that grid or not depending on if you have an off-size board. Auto re-render just gives you the resolution of your, your board renderings. Unless you are using a, an older computer, I don't know if there would ever be a reason to change this from the best resolution. Perspective allows you to turn the perspective of your virtual environment on or off. As a default, it is in perspective. It's got a vanishing point. If you toggle this, you can turn it off and it will turn it into an isometric drawing with no uh, vanishing points. Sometimes in modeling or other operations, you don't want the distortion of the perspective to be in your way. You can also adjust the position of your vanishing point with the slider. Reset tool after use is a simple tool that allows you to lock a tool into use if you wish it to. By default, after a tool is used, it will resort back to the selector tool so that you are free to select another tool. If you choose to disable this, in some operations you may want to repeat the same tool use over and over again, so that selection box is there for you to have that option. Reset Toolbars is a button for you to reset the position of your toolbars. If you've moved any of these toolbars and you're not sure how to get it back to the default position here, or one of them gets moved off of the screen and you can't find it, clicking Restore Toolbars will reset your software back to the default toolbar position.